It's a track. Let's go fast. Yeah, we're fast. Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Name. It's me, Ella, and this is episode number 37. Jesse's with me today. You can see his head right there. <laughs> Let me tilt it a little bit. Hey guys. Yeah. He just woke up from his nap and he's sitting here coloring. So he's sitting up here with me, right? You gonna sit with Mama? Yeah. Yeah. I see it's dark. I don't know if it's actually that dark to y'all. I'm sorry if it's kind of dark. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and hop into it. There's not a lot this week because I've been focusing on a couple of uh, specific things. And I've just been chilling out a lot this week. Got some... Not necessarily stress, but like stress-like-ish type things. I don't know if that makes sense. Going on, so I've just been trying, you know, like chilling and doing just relaxing crochet you know I don't know if that makes any sense and um I was staring down here because I just realized the thing yeah. I have this set on is really dirty and I need to clean it what it's yeah. a string he loves playing with strings off of like clothes or whatever hey and when guys. I sew bags which I just sewed one hey guys. I keep saying hey guys I have no truck. yeah I when I'm sewing thing. bags he likes to play with all the little strings that I cut off of you know from sewing so we're just gonna go bye ahead and bye. get into it. He's probably gonna talk bye a lot, bye. but that's okay. Bye bye. Saying bye, bye. Where'd you, gonna, go? you gonna color? I don't know. Where'd it go? You gonna color with blue and red? Yeah. There they are. All right. I have five finished objects this week, but they're all the same thing. <laughs> so I don't really. I already got price tags on them because uh, they're going in my box for um, the Earth Day thing, and they came out different sizes because I used two different brands of yarn. But it don't matter. And it's elf bombs. <laughs> There's five of them. So I have six made all together because I made one last week and then these five um, since last week. But they're just the elf bomb. It's a bomb. They're a little wonky shaped. I gotta like shape them out. But uh, I think they're cute. So like these two are really big. And then these ones are small compared to them. This is Red Heart Super Saver. This is Mainstays. This is um Walmart's Mainstays, I guess. You dropped it. You need some help. Careful. There. You can do it. You got it. Go find it. He dropped one of the pins. I feel like this is angled weird. I hope it doesn't fall. Now that I said that, it'll fall. But yeah, I think these are these are super cute. I have this pattern in my brain. I can make the whole thing without looking at a pattern. Super quick and easy. And I've seen online that they're really popular, so I'm hoping these sell. I am just selling them for $5 in my area. Crochet things, you can't really sell for a lot. I don't know. It's just, it's just the way that people are in this area. You know, they don't value handmade. But with this being $5... I made all of these out of scrap balls, so nowhere's near full skein. So if someone buys this, I can afford to buy, you know, a whole skein or a skein in like a half of Red Heart or whatever. And I'm fine with that because I'm not the kind of person who crochets as a business. It's okay. I crochet as you stuck. Needs to help. There you go. Oh, you got it. You want to play with one? You can play with one. <laughs> um, like I was saying, I don't crochet as a business. I crochet as a hobby. So I don't care if I don't make a huge profit or and I don't charge my time. Um, if I was making someone a blanket or something, I would. But something like this, you know, these, I can make like two of these in an hour. I'm not going to sit there and calculate, you know, oh, $15 an hour plus you know the black the red the white divided by three or whatever or times three in the stuffing I'm not gonna go into that you know that amount of thought of it because I'm not worrying about making a huge profit I'm just happy to make a little bit of money with scrap yarn that I've had forever so that I can buy either more yarn or actually um this this what is it called Earth Day Market is on the 21st of April, and then the next weekend after that, we're having Jesse's birthday party on the 29th. Because his birthday is May 1st. 
So, and if I make a lot of money or any money on um, that, I'm probably gonna use the money to, for his birthday. We've already got the stuff for his party. Oh, uh, I have to make the cake and we gotta buy balloons. And I wanna get a pinata, but I'm probably gonna do that next week. And um, so if we do, if I do make some decent money at that thing, I will use it to buy some kind of tickets for us to go somewhere because uh, we like going on trips and stuff. Huh? Oh, wow. I say something else. He's kind of potty training, like not hardcore, but he goes every now and then. And we've we've switched him from diapers to pull-ups, which is cool. And we'll be getting him. He's getting a potty. For his birthday from my sister. She's getting him a potty seed. Can I potty? No, we're not going potty right now. Mama's filming. I should have said that word. We'll go in a minute, okay? He has peed on the potty a lot of times. And he's even did number two once on the potty. But he still uses the bathroom in his diaper. Or his pull-ups a lot. So I think he's like. He's getting used to the idea of using potty. Anyways, back to the bomb. <laughs> I kind of went off on a tangent. But. This is a free PDF download from Ravelry by Liz Jelzma. I don't know how to say that. And I use Red Heart Super Saver Black, Hot Red, and White, and these littler ones as mainstays black. And it's just stuffed with fiber fill. <laughs> these are just little tags I got at Walmart. There's like 25 for a couple bucks. And um, scrap yarn that I tied them on there with. But uh, I have a whole diaper box over here full of stuff that I'm sending to that. I'm hoping to sell a lot of it just to use for this birthday. My hair looks crazy because I washed it and it air dried so it's kind of fluffy. <laughs> I'm planning on getting a haircut in probably a couple weeks and Jesse's hair will get cut next week because I want it to be cut before his birthday party so that the pictures he looks are bad. <laughs> not crazy. Be careful. Use your strings. All right, that's my finished objects this week. I guess I did kind of finish one in a sense. I finished a big hunk of it. And I'll go ahead and talk about that next. That's my huge octopus. Um, it's pattern. It's a paid for pattern that was gifted to me. It is by Mama Mosley Creations. I used a K-hook and the yarn I used for this part is Bernat Blanket. I think it's dark gray. But this is the part that you saw last week. You're not stuck. Wow. Wow. Hello. You standing up. Say hi. Ah, you're so cute. I sit down. You sit down, be careful. Don't want you to fall. But y'all saw it last week. I finished the uh, tentacles. It's pretty the bag. Yeah, it's a pretty bag, huh? Don't mess with it, be good. It's gonna be great. That's a cat. But I finished, this is the whole top part. The, ball. the head, and nope, you don't need all of those. You're gonna break them. Or not break them, but squish them up. Yeah. Go play with them, please. Well, quick. Leave them alone. <laughs> you a stinky butt. Oh. Here, go play with them. Mama don't care, go play with them. <laughs> but I finished all the, this is the whole top part of the octopus. I feel like the tentacles are short, but I don't know, it's still gonna be huge and cool. The whole top gray part is finished. There. And then I started the underneath. You dropped one, yep. Mama can't get her bag open. It's pulling out the wrong way. Alright. This next part is made with Burnett Blanket um, Purple Plum. I don't know why it's called Purple Plum because it's more like a maroon color. Hey guys. Hey guys. And I finished the whole bottom, and now I'm to the point where I have to make... I should need to wrap a ball. Yeah, there's a ball. What color is it? It's a ball. What color is it? It's a black. Black, yeah. It's a black. This is the whole underneath, like it's belly, I guess. Uh, and I'm to the point now where I have to make all the tentacles again. Oh. <laughs> I was looking for the camera, I forgot what side it was on. Um, all the tentacles again, and then they will be sewn to hey underneath. Guys. Hey, guys. So once I finish that, all I have left to do is yeah, sew them together, stuff it, and make the head, which is two, or the head, the eyeballs, which are two big balls. 
this this project is super fast. Bubba, you shaking the camera. You gonna make people sick. You gonna make people sick. Mm. Uh, I can't. I got that stuffed in my bunny bag just because it was empty and laying beside me. This is what did I have in this? I can't remember now what I had in this. Maybe the f bombs. It was oh. beside me empty. Let's throw the octopus back down on the chair. Get it out of the way. Whoa, 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 hoo, hoo, hoo. we're shaking the camera. You need to sit down. You got ink on your face. Whoa. You got ink on your face. And then. <laughs> already it's okay. You want to throw them? <gasps> You're throwing elf bombs around. <laughs> That's inappropriate. Yeah. Luckily, you have no idea what it is. It's just balls to you, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Back to the people on the computer or TV or phone. Dude, it's not cool. Can I do the one game ball? That's not cool. You don't throw stuff like that. I'm trying to dig this out of the bag. This is my um, snowman square for the um, Christmas pixel afghan. Where is it? I dropped. Oh, excuse you, burped. That Terry at Yarn Joy Podcast is doing a crochet along. I am a month behind so far. <laughs> I'm trying to get caught up, but every time I pick this up, I just don't have the oomph for it. But I did get one row done yesterday. And this is it so far. I'm using this is Red Heart Super Saver Cherry Red, Red Heart Super Saver Spring Green, and I think those are just called Blue. Red Heart Super Saver Blue. Baba, you moving the camera all over the place. Camera is that? It's gonna be a square. Kind of rebel on. Yeah, you can't have these though. No, you play with these ones. You can't have those ones. Those are still attached to something. That's in my skeleton bag. That is a free pattern by Sarah Zimmerman. Whoa! Are you shaking it. <laughs> I'm sorry. You're gonna have to quit shaking the table, baby. I saw it. It's okay. Look at you. It's pretty back. Yeah, it's a pretty back. You want that? There you go. You can play with that. Okay. Free pattern by Sarah Zimmerman. I'm using the elf hook and doing mini corner to corner. Um, there's an issue with that though. I noticed I was cleaning out my closet and uh, organizing my crochet stuff that's piled up in there. And I got out my two previous hey stories. January and February. Hey guys. Morning. Yeah. <laughs> He's saying good morning, guys. He's saying hey, guys, morning. Anyways, uh, it's not morning. It's, I'm Three o'clock. But my Santa square and my Christmas tree square are different sizes. The Christmas tree square, I think, is like a couple inches bigger each direction than the Santa one. So I'm gonna have to deal with that. I'm not sure why. I know it's. I know why. Guys. Guys. Yeah. It's. Whoa! You gonna fall here? Let's get this closer. Let's get this closer. Woo! I know that it's because I, uh, I'm using two different brands of yarn. I probably shouldn't have done that. But it's done, and I'll just have to deal with it by adding borders to whichever ones is shorter. Back, it's mama's back. Yeah, it's mama's back. Leave it alone. It's pretty. Yeah, it's pretty bad. <laughs> um, tap, the last. Tap, tap, tap. tap, tap. Oh, oh. Hey. Whee! Dude, quit shaking the table. The last whip that I have is Miss Super Snappy, which is oh. paper pattern. Oh, uh oh, it fell down. By Heidi Yates, which is Snappy Tots. I got my poor uh, yarn. I need to roll it up. I normally do when they get that floppy. I have a yarn winder, but it's in my yarn coat, and I never dig it out. I usually just roll them in balls. All right, oh, where's her other arm? Y'all have already seen her arms. This is like her shoulder part, and these are her hands. This is, I love this yarn, Light Peach. I love this color for skin. I've never used it before. I usually use Red Heart Super Saver Buff, but it's like a dingy color. And then I saw somewhere online that people was using this one, and when I actually got it, it's really pretty. And I love this yarn, it's real soft anyways. And you've already seen her body. You won't be that long. This would be the front of her body, her face, her or so in like her butt or whatever her butt area and front area whatever the back of her head back and butt 
oh. it's made ragdoll oh. style and i believe these will be cut later these are just loop stitches but they'll be cut to make butt. hair but but yeah it's her butt her booty her honky tonk badonky donk her tail in her biscuits and then on the crochet chat it's not yours it's mommy's Dad. This is a leg can and a I, foot. I finished one of her make, legs. Can I make a piece? You can see it, but I'm gonna get back from you a little bit. So I have to make stop, her other leg, stop, stop. sew all her appendages to her body, oh. stuff her, and then make her clothes and do the details on her face. So I'm getting done with her slowly but surely. So um, I did finish that leg in the last uh, crochet chat. I think it was the last one. I gotta ball this up because it's falling apart. <laughs> That'd be alright though. Stuff it in there. He's playing with that leg though. There's all my whips. I have a couple that I'm, I'm about to start. One is a monkey. Catherine, the girl that I babysit. Um, she Where wants. Catherine, you go. Catherine is at school. She's probably on school bus right now, going home. Yes. You'll see her in a few days. No. He loves Catherine too. Oh, no. I'm gonna burn out. I gotta turn air on. But um, no. can I talk, please? Mama, try and talk. No. You need to go play. Here, go play with these. Oh, you gonna drop that? And it's gonna make a loud noise. He's trying to fall up the chair. <laughs> but what was I saying? She wants me to make her a monkey. She wants like a big monkey, and I finally found a pattern okay. that's like a. Cover. Good size monkey. Cover. I don't know what you're giving them. They're over there somewhere. Look for them. Stop. There's a string on Mama's foot. He just bought a string them all the way. He loves strings. He'll get them and he'll ball them up and like all ball and play with them. But uh, <laughs> she wants a monkey and she wants it made out of Red Heart Super Saver Black Light, Red Heart Super Saver go. Neon Stripes. He's at work. Daddy went to work while you was napping. Yeah, he went to work. You found another one? Awesome. It's a string. That's an airplane. Air, little airplane. I heard it too. Daddy's at work. Okay. Where'd she go? It flew away. It flew away. Yeah, it flew through the sky. It's taking people somewhere. I hear the church bells now. Do you hear the church bells? Everything's just making noises right now. Apparently, oh, well, it's three o'clock. I saw it. Yeah, it's three o'clock, so the bells are ringing. You hear them? Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. Um, I don't know what I saying. Oh, yeah. Catherine wants a monkey. She wants it made out of Red Heart Super Saver, Black Light, Red Heart Super Saver, Neon Stripes, which are two black and multicolored yarns. And she also wanted some of it made out of Red Heart Super Saver. <sighs> Cherry cola, but I can't remember what parts. I know she wanted the arms and legs made out of cherry cola, and she wanted the body made, I think, out of black light, and then the head made out of neon straps. It's gonna be a very funky looking monkey, but I'm gonna make it the way she wants it because she wants it that way. And I am gonna do like the muzzle uh, solid black so that the facial, the smile. But if I make it a black muzzle, I'm gonna have to make this smile like a weird color, but it's gonna be a weird color monkey, so I'd, I'll figure it out but I do I have the yarn already pulled out and in a bag I'm just waiting to get started on it I really want to finish my super snappy and the octopus like really soon and um the hat hat the hat we don't have a hat the only hat I know of is daddy's and it's on his head at work the octopus is right there you can play with him already weaved in the ends and everything you can play with him Oh, he might think that's a hat because I <laughs> put it on my head quite a few times. But <laughs> I think that's everything about my whips. I do, I found a cute little fox that I want to make with some of the yarn. It's stuck. Is it stuck? It's not stuck. It's just heavy. He's just a big, heavy toy. It's going to be even bigger in a few days so I'm going to get it. <sighs> You're sad? Why are you sad? Oh, I'm just it's an octopus. It'll look more like an octopus when Mama gets done with it. <laughs> He's so funny. 
I love you. Where does he go? Oh, He's behind the blind. Um, there's a little fox I want to make out of the yarn that Barbara sent me. I think it's Barbara. I'm getting confused now. I've got three packages this week by three different people, so it's kind of runs together. Pretty sure it was Barbara. It was like an orange flecky yarn. And I want to make a little fox out of it. I thought that'd be cute. And then uh, I found a little pattern for a little um, Norwal that I want to make. Not a Norwal. What is it called? Manatee. A little manatee. That's a mini one. I thought I'd make a few of those. And then I kind of wanted to make like that same thing but bigger. I really like using blanket yarn. I really wish it was cheaper because I would love to make giant everything. <laughs> I love amigurumis, little ones and big ones, but I really like an octopus. Bless you, times three. That one got me in the eyeball. <laughs> He's doing his alphabet. Um, yeah. There's a lot of parents I want to make. And um, the Earth Day event is in a week, a little over a week from, well, you'll see this on Friday the 13th. Ooh. <laughs> um, and then a week from today and then another day, it's next Saturday, is the Earth Day event. I think it's two days. I think it's Saturday and Sunday. Maybe it's just one day. I can't remember. But, um, I, I want to, you know, I've already got everything made for that that I'm going to make for it. Dude, you better not be proud to my yarn. Mom's going to get you. <laughs> and, um, there's a Christmas one later this year, obviously. It's like in November or maybe early December that a church hosts and they let, you know, just not just members of the church sell, but just anybody. You can pay like a fee and it goes to the church and then you can sell stuff. So I'm wanting to make a bunch of little amigurumis and stuff. I'm watching you. I can see you. Yeah. Dude, give me that. Stop. The wind's supposed to play with mama's yarn, you know that. Unless I give it to you. I want to make some of those little manatees and stuff for that. Because everybody loves manatees. And I want to make a bunch of Christmas amigurumis. Maybe some... Um, a Santa Claus. A Santa Claus. Yeah, I'll, I'll make a Santa Claus. I'll make a few Santa Clauses. <laughs> He's all ready for Halloween. He'll pick up his Easter bucket and come to me when he wants puffs, which are cheese puffs. And he'll say, trick or treat. Hey, Jesse, say trick or treat. Say trick or treat. Okay, you don't have to say it. Did you drop your string? He, lost, he threw his string in my yarn box. I think he, he did that just so he could get into the yarn box. I'm like, the sunlight is getting weird. Let me move you guys a little bit. That's the lid to Mama's yarn box. One of them. I got four of them stacked up already. Plus one with balls in it. I got it. I got it. Oh, this is Friday the 13th at later in the day, I think. I don't know. Maybe morning. Anyways, I will be drawing the winner today. <laughs> Like future me will be drawing it. So congratulations to whoever won. I will be sending it out as soon as I can. I already got it all in a box. Well, I got it in a U.S. flat rate. So if someone outside the U.S. wins it, I don't have to switch boxes. But for now, it's just living in a U.S. flat rate box. It's yarn. You don't need to mess with it. The gray. Yeah, it's gray. What color is? What color? It's gray. Gray. Yeah, it's gray. <laughs> He's playing with lots of uh, Bernat blanket yarn. Whoa. You can play with it for a few minutes. Let Mama finish, and then I'll get it from you. I got it. I got it. Yeah. I got it. All right. The only things I have some acquisitions, I but I forgot to. One of them I already made something. It was the liner for the bag for the giveaway. <laughs> it was like a um, off white back quarter. There's two of them. Uh, to make a liner because it's I got it over there, but I did post a picture of it. I'll, put, I'll throw it up a picture of it. Ignore the paint spots. This apartment, you know, is well lived in. A lot of people lived in it, and they apparently just spot paint, and so the color is off. It don't bother me any because I know we're not gonna live here forever, probably for a few more years, but not forever. He is making a mess. That's okay. 
Uh, the only other things I need to mention is the Cakewalk Cow starts tomorrow, April 14th. I'm excited for starting because I want to use some of my Karen cakes um, that I've been gifted. I have three and I plan on using all three of them to make something with. And I've got, I don't even know how many mandala cakes left. Yeah. And I know I have four um, Premier Sweet Rolls. I have two each in a gray and white color and a purpley white color. It's gelato, gelato pop and silver stripes or pop or something like that. I don't know. But, um, so I've got a lot of projects I want to make. I know in my mandala, there's a tank top that I want to make a couple of. Well, I want to make one of and see how it looks on me. And then if I like it, make more. Um, I think it takes two mandala cakes for my size. Um, and it's kind of, I think it's a kerchief. Uh, tank top or something like that. I found it months ago and I knew I wanted to make mandala, use mandala for it. So I'm going to be starting that between now and October. And I do know with the Karen cakes, I'll probably make two of them will be market bags and one of them is going to be oh, wow. an immigrant. The Rainbow Sprinkles, I think it's called, that uh, Hannah sent me for the Cozy Cottage Crochet. It's going to be immigrant because it's awesome looking. I don't know what kind yet, but something. Nope, you can't have that yarn. Yeah. Nope, 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 not that one. Play with the gray one. It's easier to untangle. <laughs> oh, thank. I hope so. Oh, geeks. Gray, fall down. And the last thing I want to talk fall about down. is. Oh wait. Well, did I even say anything about the cow? It starts tomorrow on my Facebook group, which is linked below, and also on Mo from Unseen Strands Ravelry group, which I'll link it below too. Uh, you can post in either of them and win, you know, for both of them. But to win the prizes I'm giving away, you have to participate on the Facebook group. And to win the prizes, to try to win the prizes she's giving away, you have to participate on her rivalry group. Um, I don't know if she's going to have multiple winners. I might. Right now, it's just one. But, uh, you know, it's six months. So, i got plenty of time to come up with um, gifts. Are you tooting? Don't toot. It's rude. <laughs> But, um, so yeah, uh, all the links will be below, and it starts tomorrow, not, yeah, tomorrow, April 14th, which is my mom's birthday, um, and it goes through October 14th, which is Mo's birthday, you use cake yarn, she is allowing you to use yarn that you caked yourself, but she requires you to show a picture of your caked yarn, so you can't just use any yarn and claim that it was caked, I guess. I just want people to use actual cake yarn. I know it's kind of picky, but like Karen Cake, Sweet Rose, uh, Mandala, all those European brands. I don't know what they all are. Those fancy, you know, the German, any kind of pre-caked yarn. Will you quit pulling everything out of there, you stinky butt? You can't have that red yarn. Jesse. It's heavy. Yeah, it's heavy. Play with the gray. You can't have Mama's big red ball of yarn. Scanning yarn. <sighs> Kids. Last thing I want to talk about is my secret that I've been keeping from you guys. Uh, regarding the email. I'm not going to talk about it in this video. I'm going to make it its own video. And I'm hoping to do that tomorrow on the 14th. I will film it. Hopefully. I'm waiting for something to come in the mail. And it should be here Saturday or Monday. Hopefully Saturday. Um, and then I can talk about it more. Because I can show it to you and talk about it. So it's it's, it's blah, 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 can't talk. It's exciting to me because it's going to be fun for me. And it will also be fun for you because it, it might include giveaways and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm pretty excited to share it with you guys. And I just realized it's really scuffy. I know what that is too. You see all that gunk right there? That's from Devin's hands. He works in a factory. He's a maintenance something. <laughs> And, uh, he gets real dirty and he usually he tries to clean up but that right there's where we keep our garbage can i need to magic erase that because i usually do that me and jesse will go around i'll give him one and i'll use one and i'll actually clean spots and jesse will just like clean wherever he's scrubbing <laughs> so i need to do that door <laughs> yeah i guess i'm gonna go ahead and hop off here because i gotta edit this a little bit because of jesse and um get it uploading that's all animal out there but yeah so i will see you guys really soon in that video about the secret thing <laughs> and probably sometime this weekend 
for a um, crochet and chat. And actually, later today or earlier today, you may have already seen it. The giveaway video. That's going to fall and hit you in the hand. Be careful. Oh, no. <laughs> so, I'll see you guys in whichever video comes up next. Um, all the links I've talked about will be below. My Facebook group, my Ravelry <coughs> page, my Ravelry group, and my Instagram. The Facebook group is most active. And every time I hit a new 100 people, I will give away a pattern. We are at close, we're closing in to 200, so. We're going to cover? Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and hop off here and clean up all this mess that he just made in the floor with yarn. Okay. And I will see you guys in the next video. It is coming. You wanna say bye bye? Say bye bye. <laughs> the blue color. Color? You wanna color? I gotta find them. I found them. Bye guys.